most of the commentary, as I was joking about, was just like me. Don't run back to the Odyssey, just warp back to it. <sighs> Actually, make the game convenient for yourself. Don't play it like Dark Souls. <laughs> there aren't Goombas anymore! Hmm. That's not good! I'll have to look that up later. They wanted to have... Unless they did move... Yeah, unless they did move them. Well, before we do stop... Get that fire, bro, and see if you can break that cheese. See where that goes. They, they wouldn't have moved the Goomba. That's stupid, especially because... You can't break the cheese, either. That's dumb. There has to be a way to return it to the previous phase, then. Or a way to get those types of enemies to spawn back. That's really dumb. Like, really? There's really... obviously an answer to that. We just don't know it. There was a way to go back to the one form of New Donk City. So because of that, there has to be a way to get the, um, the chefs back and to get the Goombas back. There's this platform over here. And a cannon. We can move on, that's so this is ridiculous. And then there's just these blocks I can never deal with. You can't deal with those until way later, yep. apparently. So. How do we get the Goombas back? Hmm. Because I need the Goombas and I need the guys with the frying pan! There's obviously some way to do it. That's stupid. stop in a second, but really? What do you do? How would you return? Because, like, I missed the one thing, and now it's impossible because there are no Goombas! There's obviously just something somewhere here that that lets you go back. I don't know what the hell it would be, but it's That's something. so dumb! <laughs> I'll stop in a minute, but that's so dumb! Ah. Oh, good lord. Game. Commentary, like I said, was all over the place. Head to Bowser's Kingdom. Holy shit! That's a short ass game right there! Well, this is a thing! Wait, I think I had heard about this uh, kingdom. This should. This should be what I think it is, unless the. So, we are speeding through the, the Bowser in Bowser's Kingdom, is that Bowser? And what, you know, I actually just thought about, because people said apparently some things, uh, I was expecting there to maybe be another Bowser, balls. is Bowser on a dragon? Holy fuck yes. Bowser is on a dragon! <laughs> 
Taking Bowser for a Wyvern Rider. Actually, I guess he would be a Wyvern in Walmart. And it's so. That dragon looks like something out of Monster Hunter while Mario and. Or like fucking Skyrim or something. Holy shit, Bowser is a rapper almost. I think I said that right. The fuck? Bowser has a dragon now, apparently. Holy god. Ruined kingdom. Mm. Crumbled <laughs> uh. You need three. Ah, uh, I guess we landed in um the Tim Burton world now. Boys and the girls of every age, wouldn't you like to see that something gets You see, the funny thing about that is we were actually recording this on, um... October 31st. Come with us and you will see Didn't you this say you... of Halloween. Didn't you say we were going to stop? I guess we could fight the dragon. <laughs> oh, fuck it up! What is this? Garden! <laughs> This, well, this is out of place as fuck. And the T-Rex wasn't? Okay, so those are just... Every boss has to have a shockwave attack. You know, looking at its face, it looks like it is designed to be climbed up. Haha! <laughs> like... This is like this is a 180 right here. Yeah, this is gold, but damn, this is. Oh yeah, it just times all up. Yeah. Surprisingly easy, boss. <laughs> Wait, we would just actually. You know what? Uh -huh. If this is a boss battle, we'd get three moons. Yeah. Then we could move on, drop off, and like Bowser's area for real, and call it a day. Go, 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 yes! Barely! Did we just beat an Elder Dragon from Monster Hunter? Yeah, three moons! Like, why is this here? Like, seriously, why, why is this here? We, uh, it, we have this, just this giant dragon right here. In contrast to everything else. <laughs> I, I hope my blind reactions are worth it. God almighty, damn. Can't always be funny, so I just ramble and bring up miscellaneous porn. Which there's not a lot for Odyssey. Wait, wait, did it stop? Well, there isn't. You know, it's very convenient that every time this thing has ended up crashed, there is exactly enough moons in the area to continue. I mean, imagine if this thing needed four moons, we would be fucked. This ship is taking quite the beating and the paint's peeled off. It's been like that for a while, which is hilarious. Dovahkiin. Mario would kick the shit out of the Dovahkiin. Just casually. 
That was certainly a doozy of an interruption. Mario can also beat Goku. <laughs> Bowser's Kingdom. It looks like we only have enough room on the cell for one more. Okay, so you see, it turns out Bowser's a giant, um, a closeted weeaboo. Infiltrate Bowser's castle. You see, it turns out Bowser's a giant weeb. Anime. Mm -hmm. The showdown. <laughs> There's no count. Oh, yeah. We just go. I will stop here. It's just a second. I'm just curious. What I was going to say before that dragon interruption, maybe after you beat the game, um... Okay, so we got... We got a checkpoint flag. Yeah. This enemy, it's basically it's a woodpecker, so it can uh, poke things. You can poke into walls and climb things. There's apparently platforming challenges about it. Also, I want to make a Woody Woodpecker joke, but I'm not sure if our audience would get that. Oh, that's also another thing. When you pin into walls, um, you're basically, you have the abilities of those flicking pole things. This is so cool! We need to stop! But damn! Again, if you don't know uh, who Woody Woodpecker is, stop watching this. You're too young. I can kind of on the front of you for a Oh my god! Uh, okay, we seriously do need to stop. You know what? No. Let's get one move. Um, there's no counter, so I don't know if they're like. Oh! Huh. Oh! There's no counter because Odyssey doesn't need. You just get moons and go. Oh. I really should stop. <laughs> yes, yes, you should. Smart bombing! Hmm. Ah! <laughs> yeah. So you just get moons as you go. See, and now that's added to the counter. Uh huh. Okay, seriously, dude, stop. I want to sleep now. Um. Actually, wait, th there is one thing. I don't want you to do it, but walk around this area, it might be... Okay, I don't know what part of the level it is, but there's um one part of this level to where if you can find it and you want to grind um money, there's essentially this one bonus that every time you complete it, you're put down really close to the bonus. Because of that, you can keep infinitely re-going into... Okay. Yeah. I'll point it out when we get closer but basically hidden somewhere in the stage there is a uh, bonus that has a ton of those gold coin rings and after you beat the bonus you're dropped down very close to it so you can just keep infinitely entering it getting the money from it and you know keep repeating until you get max coins which is like four nines okay so stop if i'm right yes I was totally right. Now we can load a save. And start back right here, Al. I'm about to... Um, oh, there's like... Some coins. <laughs> Damn it. They're literally... Look! Mm. Oh! Look at the coin! I don't... Oh. It's a mouth charm! Oh, it's that... Because that's... Oh, it really is a... Closet it, weeaboo! Make a joke about that, but that wasn't that actual yin. I think. Yeah. Okay. So anyway, I'm 
calling this a set of recordings. We just kind of rambled. I played the game for about three hours. There's going to be a lot of cuts in between these videos. It's just me blind... Just me making blind reactions, making random jokes. But we need to call this a recording session. If I'm ending a video here, then next time we'll play through this area, probably end up beating it, going to another area, if there is one after this, I think there is, or if we end up beating the game, then it gets to the point of the crazy 100%, but I can discuss that more then. For now, if I'm ending the video, I'm going to do an outro and um, in the video here, if I'm not ending the video and I continue off, I'm just going to connect um, parts together. So I'm going to be silent a couple of seconds in case I want to connect this to another recording. If not, then I'll do a proper outro and try to end a part with that outro. So I'm going to be quiet just a second in case I'm editing parts together. Okay, so if you're hearing this, I'm ending a part with it. I hope you guys enjoyed this set of Super Mario Odyssey videos. We got a lot done in this recording session. I just kind of awkwardly rambled a lot. But anyway, see you guys next time. Okay, guys. So my question of the day is, did the Lord of Lightning catch you guys off guard too? Normally, you wouldn't see a dragon like this in a Mario game. Like I said, it looks like something out of Monster Hunter. It doesn't really look like something that belongs in a Mario game. But because of that, I think this is a very iconic moment in this game that personally sticks out in my mind. This was a very cool surprise. But anyway, I would really love to know what you guys think. You can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments below. Or you can leave them on social media. All my social media links are in the video description. Now, as always, I need to be a show for a minute. If you liked my video, please hit the like button and leave some comments. If you're new to my channel and want to see more of my videos, please hit the subscription button and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, please ring the bell next to the subscription button. That gives you the proper notifications of whenever I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media. Doing all of these things really helps out the channel and it really helps our communities grow. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys next time.